Hello and welcome to a linear haul. Would you stay till the morning light? Or would you follow me? Or would you let it be? If I leave tonight, we could do this right. We'll find the remedy. Or would you stay with me now till the morning light? Today I'm very excited because we were talking about a sustainable yet affordable, yet women empowering, yet luxurious jewelry brand. And I feel like, cause loads of celebrities also wear this brand, a very nice way to connect women of all backgrounds together. And honestly, I think that's my favorite part because it really shows you that the jewelry has quality because people far and wide are buying it. But also that it's affordable. Like I'm a student, but I didn't think of buying one of these pieces that I would completely shatter the bang. And there is sterling silver base, a nice thick gold plating over it. I feel like these pieces will last you a lot longer than other jewelry you can get um, for less. So highly recommend and I vouch for it and I have been wearing it and it has passed the test of my recklessness with jewelry. No diamonds were harmed in the making of this video. The shipping was good as well. So I live in the UK and I believe they're based in the US, but it probably shipped within two weeks, which is pretty decent because they also try to offset their carbon emissions. So I respect any effort to reduce my carbon footprint genuinely. Like we never think about these things and it's really nice when a company takes the initiative to kind of help reduce it. But that aside, I wanted to show you some of the pieces I've got. Hello, it's me from the future, here to right a wrong. I initially filmed this saying the wrong name of the earring and I'm here to fix that. So the first item you're gonna see are a gorgeous pair of pearl drop earrings by the name Adriana, which are the ones I have on now. I have to say I am honestly wearing these quite religiously because it's fall, right? And everything I wear is dark. It's like covering everything, like turtlenecks, blazers, puffers, and you don't really get to show much of your character that way. I feel like in the summer you can wear really beautiful dresses, you can wear like spring makeup, you can wear like bright shoes, but in the fall winter I feel like everyone just wants to be warm and myself included, I just give up on any sense of color. I genuinely think you can dress up and add character and flair to any outfit by popping on a pair of earrings. It's been a little personal philosophy of mine for a long time. Like if I'm about to go to class in a hoodie and I'm just feeling like, you know, I could do a bit better, but I literally cannot be bothered, I will pop on a pair of nice earrings just so that it, it demonstrates like, hey, I put in some effort into this outfit, even though it wasn't me, you know, wearing a ball gown to class, I'm, I'm still looking fresh. And I feel like these earrings definitely give that effect and even more because I find this pair of earrings to be super unique in the sense that I love pearls and I have like pearl studs and I have like um, pearl drops but this I love how the hoop is actually quite asymmetrical so it gives a very nice artistic spin to the earring in general and I love how the pearl is just so eye-catching like I see it in the viewfinder and it just looks fabulous I feel like I do gravitate towards jewelry that's like middle ground, meaning it's not mega petite where like you can't see it if you weren't like right up close to me, but I'm also someone that strays away from really big statement pieces. It's like this perfect balance of just elegance. And I honestly wear this whenever I wear hoodies, when I wear a nice top, and I genuinely feel like every time I wear these, it just makes my outfit look more classy. The next one is called Elizabeth and it is a mother of pearl ring, which I've got on here. I feel like saying this ring is vintage is really true to the style of it. I do feel like putting it on, it gives that, I don't know, like 80s jewelry vibe. I, I, when I was like 15, I was obsessed with this one ring I got from like Claire's or something. And it was just this like red oval and it had like a white embezzlement of Marie Antoinette on it or something. But I purely loved it because of the style, which is very much akin to this, where it's got that beautiful 
oval shape with like a picture frame almost like a rim around the edge and then it's got that standout middle which is white and it really just catches your attention like as i'm moving my hands around I'm, I'm sure you can notice it and catch a glimpse of it and i really think that it matches these earrings i think that was my method behind this choice selection was that i'm someone that is more go with what you know so if i really like jewelry i'll just wear the same thing all the time um so i feel like these two are just so beautiful together and they are, look like a set and that's why i love pairing them together so you don't really have to put much method into like what 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 should i match today it's just a bit of they're just perfect together i got this one in a size six i don't know if that means anything to you like if you can compare my hand to yours it might be somewhat helpful um I, it was my intention to get it for this finger here so if you want to get it in like these two fingers you probably want to go for like a seven or an eight um but yeah if you want like ring finger size like size six is like where it's at and the last thing i got was a set of rings and it's called fria and ada and i was genuinely 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 persuaded by the instagram photos they had on their website like the girl holding the wine glass i was like i want my hands to look like that when i'm holding the wine glass with i think a lot of it is because it's got a very strong pinterest aesthetic ring for fall vibe like the way it looks like little leaves um but with diamonds i feel like that's like definitely what you want in life um i also like how this is semi-adjustable so if i were to take it off um it's not fully connected so i technically could fit it also on my thumb because it's got that like i don't know how to show you because it's got that like push power to like expand it a bit without being too much so i like how it gives you that chance to like wear it on different fingers and like because it comes in a set of two which is super helpful um you can wear it on different hands on different days you can kind of switch up the mood i personally like um the way it fits just as on one hand because i usually wear it in conjunction with this set like this is literally my go-to jewelry getup. i think this is the end of the video um but i really hope you enjoyed seeing some pretty jewelry on a bit of a gloomy sunday and I really, really hope you check out their website because I think they have a good sale on right now for Black Friday. So I will link their website below and you should definitely check it out and treat yourself to something nice if you want. And yeah, I am sure I will see you again very soon. And in the meanwhile, thank you for watching. Bye. Would you stay till the morning light? Or would you follow me? Or would you let it be? If I leave tonight, we could do this right We'll find the remedy Or would you stay with me now Till the morning